a base hit into right field. Sunberg will stop at third as Mark Grace lines a single in the right field on a 2-1 pitch, and that's his first big league hit. Three and two. High fly ball to left field and pretty deep. Back goes Mitchell to the Ivy. Gone. Boy, he is amazing, and the Giants will agree he is eight for 11 with two home runs against the King. This will get the run home and maybe more. Way back in right and off the Ivy. At least a double. Grace is content with that. 2 nothing Cubs. Best hitter consistently on their ball club. Mark Grace hit 314 during the year. The 1 0 pitch to the Cubs cleanup hitter. Rip down the right field line. center back goes Maldonado but way back and it is off the wall Grace into second base with a long double the Giants have been trying to make him put it into play to left field and he promptly bangs it into right center for a base hit it gets by Sheridan and Walden is around third he will score Grace is on his way to third and Robbie Thompson will run it back to the infield Pat Sheridan tried to backhand it on a dead run and came up with a glove full of empty. And the Cubs now are the tying run 90 feet away. Two for three today on a day when hits have been hard to come by. This one will loop to right. It is a fair ball. The run around second goes to third. Here comes Grace to the plate. Here comes the throw. He's safe. Left center field, that's going to tail away and goes by the dive of Derrick Bell. So Grace will be in with a double at second base with two out. In the center field, two in a row, single by Vizcaino. And now here's Mark Grace, who's in an eight of nine. In fact, one of the hardest balls to get was hit the right field. And that could be deep trouble to the wall, and it is off the wall. I thought it went up against the wall and then kicked away and it did. It's going to be a triple for Mark Grace. Two men off of the Cubs are the drive to right center field. Whoa, way back, back. And he does hit for the cycle. Mark Grace, a single, a double, a triple, a home run. That's one you see very rarely. Anybody hitting for the cycle and Grace did it today. One and one on Grace. High drive by Grace, right center field. This could be it, and it is. Mark Grace wins the game with a homer in the 10th. And Grace, who's been hitting in tough luck today and most of the year, hits one where nobody can make a play. The Cubs win here on the 11th inning blast of Grace. That ball in the air, foul ground. Grace over near the bullpen, and he leaps into the stands that he can. And that ball, wow! What a grab by Grace. Diving over the tarp down there, reaching into the first row of the seats, and snatching that one away. And that retires a pretty tough man. The fans thought they had a souvenir. Mark Grace has other ideas. He goes right on top of the wall, and he makes the catch. There is a looper. Hey, great catch from his back to the infield. By Mark Gray. Boy, oh boy. We're in the twilight of the evening. That wasn't too easy, easy to see, but he got back and made a great catch. This will save you some trouble if you keep Lenny Dykstra off base, and Mark Grace does just that. Had a two-run single yesterday. Wrap toward Grace, and look at that glove. Backhanded, the pitcher covers and tracks it. Two Might have been even extra bases as Grace backs up right to the line, backhands it, and makes the good throw to Traxel. Grace to left, well hit, the wind should take this, and it does.
It's blown out about 20 miles an hour to left. And Gray smartly goes the opposite way. It's a 5-1 game. In the air, deep right center. Van Slyke on the run at the wall. Goodbye. Grace has come right back with a bomb to right center, his fifth of the season. And no sooner have the Pirates tied it, the Cubs have jumped back in front five to four. Tokyo Dome in Tokyo, Japan, the venue for the opening of Major League Baseball 2000. talking about his approach to hitting earlier in the game. There are some situations you just go up there and look for a pitch to drive. The Giants and the Cubs in a playoff to determine which one will secure the wild card berth in the National League. Off the fists and Grace will take it. The Cubs have won it and they will go to the postseason. He is a three time National League All Star a winner of four Gold Glove Awards and a member of the Chicago Cubs All-Century Team. Let's have a round of applause for number 17, Mark Grace.